Hi everyone, uh, doing something a little different this week and doing a reveal of the class that's going to happen this weekend um, called Fashion by Zeka. We were supposed to be at the Hive um, to take this class in person, but unfortunately, due to everything going on right now, we are um, not able to get together. So we are going to do this by Zoom. So really excited to see um, how this works virtually. Uh, sorry you didn't get to see me open the box, but the box was enormous. But let's uh, dive right into um, what came with it. So first, let's look at the canvas. Whoops. Here it is, um, just completely smitten with these colors. And I'm not going to get too close up because I actually did a little advanced stitching, and I'll show you that in a moment. But um, look at this magnet, you guys. How cute is that? just love it um, and it came with a project bag whoops these things are flying everywhere with this make a note of this border because look at this this is the um, project bag for the threads and just like going to class uh, in person Ruth has these threads all arranged so perfectly and beautifully and they shipped beautifully. Um, I think I mixed up a few of the colors here on the end because like I said I was doing a little homework that she gave us um, but otherwise you get the full effect here of um, how beautiful it is and exciting it is to receive this. Um, we also got a pack with uh, the lessons in it and our homework behind this top sheet. And I cannot show you what's in the pack because there are instructions that say I am not allowed to open it. And I can't even peek because she's sealed it with a sticker. So um, normally in class, she will, um, the canvases will be sitting out on the table and she brings out the threads and then suddenly she reveals the canvas and what she's done with it. So really, really excited um, to see uh, what it looks like tomorrow. So I will be good, a good girl and wait. Um, but let's dive into the threads, shall we? Oh, I should have had this unzipped, apologies. So I, I do wanna mention one thing. Ruth always sends us needles, which I don't know why, that is just so helpful. I always seem to be searching for needles and I can always go into um, a project kit and know that She's thoughtfully enclosed a few needles to get me going. Um, but look at all this, um, try and get the camera on this, all this petite silk lame braid. Love it, love, love, love it. Oh look, and here's a few more. Just the colors are so exciting. Look at that, love this, it's like peacock color. Um, this looks very interesting and um, exciting to stitch with, so curious to see where that goes. Uh, here's a little more petite silk lame braid in um, a really gorgeous silvery gray. It, it's such a gorgeous color. I stitched a little with it last night. Um, and then we have some, whoops, uh, Splendor, whoops, sorry. I'm looking ahead, very velvet, oops, another Splendor in uh, some greens and then oops bear with me here we have some panache i think that's how you say it uh, fireworks all glisteny and then neon rays and this um great orange there's gonna be a lot of orange on this i think um here's some floche more orange I'm gonna take a wild guess and suspect this goes on the background, but again, I don't know because I did not peek. And let's see, silks. Look at that, you guys. Ooh, I'm gonna save that one for last. Um, these beautiful that purple and shimmery gray. This is some wool. And then color dreams flush. Always my favorite. Look at this. How beautiful is that? 
um, we have some uh, beading thread that's flying out of my hands here at the moment and some more beading thread some krynic and red and let's see beads no kit is complete without beads you guys love it can't wait to see where those go and then look how exciting this is you have these daggery sequins how cool is that and i'll show you the inside of this project bag it's all polka dotted okay so that's the thread pile which i did not do a very good job of laying that out but you get the idea all the colors all the happy colors and there was a little bit of homework and it was tent stitching around the eye so i'll show you that um, it was all done in petite silk lame braid and i don't know if you can see the sparkle but there's this i think you can see a little bit so anyway just did the eyes um looks like we still have eyelashes and beak and that sort of thing to do and finally in the kit Every time we're at the Hive, uh, Ruth has this elaborate catering and it always in involves like some homemade cookies or a beautiful cake, just something that, um, I don't know, it's just a treat for going out there. So I was really surprised when I opened my box and there was this beautiful bag. Let me show you what's inside, you guys. It's a, a thoughtful and sweet um, addition, but milk bar cookies, you guys. How fun is that? And I've actually made compost cookies before, so I'm really curious to uh, try that and see if it tastes anything like what I made and the chocolate cookies. So I'm definitely going to enjoy those at some point. Um, hope you enjoy the reveal, and I am really looking forward to this weekend and seeing where uh, the stitch guide takes us. Take care. Bye.